What's going on guys? Now I'm just going to be showing you guys a few hidden features on the brand new iOS 5.0 beta. Now the only way you can get this beta is if you're a paid developer and luckily I have a few friends that I worked on the website with that hooked me up. So um, let's not waste any more time and I'll see you guys at the end of this video. And actually this is a video response to TOD's today hidden features. Um, Jonathan if you're watching this you actually beat me out to it. All I had to do was film myself talking and I had everything else filmed. So hopefully you guys like it. Um, see you guys at the end of the video. Alrighty guys, so the first feature that I noticed was in the settings feature and you go up to general and about. Now once you go there, you can actually edit your name up top to whatever you want it to be. So I have Christian Atlas's iPhone. Uh, I know previous softwares you were able, only able to name it in the iTunes application. So that's pretty cool. Now the next one is also in settings. You can go to usage and you can actually manage your applications within there so for example if i want to look at imovie you can go into imovie right here and it says how much gigabytes is left on my phone you can just hit edit you can delete the application like that or you can just hit delete and you can manage the applications like that so i think that's actually pretty cool uh, the next one is camera application and i know a lot of people were saying oh yeah apple said that you can access your your camera in the lock screen which you can and all you have to do is close it and double click the screen and the camera the camera shows up right there so all you gotta do is click it opens up right away um, this is just a picture of the wall but uh, the cool thing in this application is you can swipe from left to right and go into your pictures so that's actually pretty cool um, you can swipe back and forth to get back through the navigation screens as well the next one is in the mail application so you just open up mail and you can scroll down and you can show the different amounts of how many messages you want to show uh, I know for a lot of tech reviewers out there that get a lot of emails about comments and stuff like that this is actually pretty cool you can manage them this way um, I believe in the last one you can only do up to 200 now you have two options where you could do 500 and a thousand recent messages so that's actually pretty cool and the last one is under the phone <laughs> this is actually a pretty cool one. Uh, this was a previous city of tweak. You can manage your miss your call log, so you can pretty much delete anything that you want under the thing. So you can just hit delete right there, or you can swipe to delete stuff like that. So I think that's actually a pretty cool feature that Apple added. So that'll just wrap it up here. So there it is, guys. If you guys have any questions for me, go ahead and leave a comment down below in the box. Now, if you do want to get your hands on a copy of iOS 5.0 beta. I do have a few friends that actually have some slots open for them, uh, one of them meaning iMac the iPhone. So if you want to go ahead and check out his channel, all his information is down below in the box. Um, he has a few spots. I know, I believe he's charging like $5 or something like that. So um, stop wasting more of your time. If you guys want to go ahead and check out my last two videos right here, that's about it. This has been Christian, also known as King Alice, and you guys take it easy. Peace.